Exploring the depths in a mirror darkly. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning journey. Today, we're diving into an intriguing phrase, in a mirror darkly. This expression has rich historical and literary roots, and it offers a fascinating glimpse into how language can reflect complex ideas and emotions. Let's unravel its meaning together. In a mirror, darkly is a part of a longer phrase found in the Bible, specifically in 1 Corinthians chapter 13 verse 12. The full verse is often translated as, for now we see through a glass, darkly, but then face to face, now I know in part, but then shall I know even as also I am known. In this context, the phrase suggests seeing things imperfectly or obscurely, like looking into a dim or cloudy mirror. Historically, mirrors were not as clear as they are today. Imagine a piece of polished metal or a glass coated with metallic substances. These materials provided reflections but not with the clarity we're accustomed to now. Thus, seeing, in a mirror, darkly, metaphorically speaks to having an incomplete or unclear understanding of something. In literature, this phrase has been used to symbolize the limitations of human perception and understanding. It suggests that our grasp of the world and ourselves is partial and clouded, awaiting a future clarity of insight. Today, in a mirror, darkly, can be used to describe any situation where understanding is limited or obscured. It might refer to personal introspection, the challenges of understanding others, or the complexities of societal issues. The phrase has also been adopted in various cultural contexts, including titles for books, episodes of TV shows, and other works, often to evoke themes of mystery, introspection, or a journey towards understanding. Let's see how this phrase could be used in modern language. Personal growth. I'm looking at my past actions in a mirror, darkly, trying to understand why I made those choices. Social commentary. This documentary holds up a mirror, darkly, to the complexities of our society, showing us the parts we often overlook. In a mirror, darkly, is more than just a phrase. It's a window into how language can encapsulate deep philosophical ideas and emotions. Whether you encounter it in historical texts, literature, or modern media, it invites us to reflect on our understanding of the world and ourselves. I hope this exploration has illuminated the phrase for you, and I look forward to our next linguistic adventure together. Keep learning, and see you in the next video.